just found out, was it yesterday or the day before? The day before yesterday, no wait, was it Thursday or Friday? It was Friday. That, um, that I wouldn't be doing the Amazon runs anymore. And it turns out, you know, it didn't have anything to do with my two other co-workers, me, my boss, and another co-worker from my company, we got put on uh, some Amazon Relay runs. And I did that for two weeks, had a week off, and this was going to be my second round of two weeks. And instead, it was only one week. Um, I guess that's because Amazon is shutting down up in, they're shutting down their stuff in Vegas and Chicago. Apparently they might have had, you know, they might have overbooked some drivers. They didn't need us because they were canceling uh, quite a bit of loads on us this last week. I know my boss had like, he got his work schedule, his work block, and they canceled all his stuff in one day. And, and then one day before I even started, I was at my first pickup. Before I even went to my first pickup, at like 3 a.m. one day, um, I already had two canceled stops for that block that I was doing. Um, so just, yeah, like a lot of cancellations, like barely any empties to pick up at these stops. It was just kind of a mess. So <sighs> my dispatch called me, gave us the news. They were like, okay, kind of bad news. You're not doing Amazon for the next week, which kind of is a bummer. It's bad news in the sense that, you know, running Vegas to California or Vegas to Arizona, it's cold, but right now it's like 65 degrees at, out here. Pretty sunny, decently like warm for the most part if you stand in the sun. Um, to me, this is cold, but I'd rather I'd rather deal with this weather out here than have to you know go somewhere on the east coast or up north, and then I'm having. I'm just gonna be mad 24 7 because I hate the cold that's how much I hate the cold um, I wake up mad <laughs> so that's not gonna be fun I'm just gonna be going over the road for this week and then next week I'll be doing some stuff and I will be headed home the following week because I'm supposed to be taking a vacation for Christmas uh, on the 24th to the 31st my next couple of weeks are going to look like. Where I'm going tomorrow, I don't know. I have to wait till like 9 or 10 a.m. and hopefully I get a load kind of early. I don't really want to run into the night time. Now if it's necessary for this load, then yeah, I'll do it. But I like to stop. I like to try and stop wherever I'm at like 5 or 6 at the latest. Maybe 7 o'clock. Just to get parking and everything. Uh, but I hope I hope I get something going to Texas. That would be that would be perfect. I could I could go right through home on the 10. Don't have to deal with the cold weather up north. I do hear Washington right now isn't that bad. Now whether that changes in the next day is possible. I haven't been to Washington or Oregon in a minute. Not even Northern Cali in like a long time. It feels like a long time. It's been like since the beginning of this year, I guess. I think the beginning. I was with a different company at the beginning of this year, and with them, I was regional, and I would run up to Washington, Oregon, Southern Cali, Utah, Wyoming a lot, so that was that. So we'll see. I'm, I'm excited, and I say uh, that's, the bad, that's the bad part of going back OTR is I don't know where I'm going, and then I'm going to have to really be you know, watching out for the weather. And I know how to, like, I know how to run in the winter time, don't get me wrong. Do I like to do it? No, I don't think anybody likes to run in the winter time. <laughs> I do not like it at all. Uh, before I came out here doing the Amazon stuff, I, I had just gotten on home time right before then. And I went, I was coming from Minnesota because, and uh, I got stuck. In some snow. Well, I didn't get stuck stuck, but I went to pick up 
and within like 10 minutes of me reaching my pickup spot, the shipper, it had started to snow. By the time I got out of the dock, it was covered in snow, everything was covered in snow, and I had to drive through the entire state, the entire day, I was just in snow. So, that wasn't fun, I didn't like it, but it had to be done, I wanted to get home. Thank God I didn't crash. I felt my wheels slip a couple times during like either making a turn or just slip going on a straight line. Um, it happens, but what we don't want out here is a whole accident. We do not. It could be a very bad day. So we'll see. I'm kind of nervous. I'm kind of glad to be going back over the road. Honestly, being on the Amazon relays kind of killing me out here with the the what uh, time schedule. As we'd be picking up, I'd have to wake up like at 1:30, 2:30 to pick up these loads to get ready to pick up these loads. So it's like you know, I'm not just gonna wake up in my pajamas looking like a whole bag of crap and then go pick up my load and then just look like crud all days. It's not happening. Uh, maybe once in a blue moon I might do that if I really don't care. You know, I also brush my hair, look presentable, but uh, if I really don't care and I just want to get the load where it's going, yeah, I have woken up. I will wake up uh, in my pajamas, toss on my little fuzzy slippers that I got, which are great by the way, and, and you know, just hit the road. Hey guys, I'm back. My shit cut off earlier. I guess I didn't have enough storage on the phone and here's a motorcycle. Pull out right next to my tire. <sighs> but I just picked up my trailer from Palmdale, my company trailer. And now I am headed uh, 40 miles back to the 15 on this crusty old highway out here. 138 and from there I'll be going down into Ontario and parking it for the day. Woo. Also frogs are cute. They got some good looking food places out in California, I'm not gonna lie. As much as I hate this place because I'm a trucker, I do wish I had a lot more time and availability to go to like something that looks cute or you know something that looks good to eat which I mean I got my places don't get me wrong Ontario the mall Ontario Mills Mall is like literally not even a mile from the truck stop like across the freeway all you gotta do is like walk across the freeway and go across the bridge and it's like right there <sighs> And, uh, oh my god. That one's on your right? I don't know. And, um, yeah, they have, like, some stuff in there, but I go to this one place each and every time that you can get, uh, a cup of corn called an, uh, elote. So it's just a cup of corn, warm corn, with mayonnaise, I think it's called cotija cheese, something like that. And, uh, Taijin? I don't use that much. I'm not trying to say it's all weird. I know I got the accent down, but it's yeah, still. I don't feel comfortable. Uh, so it's lemon, Taijin, cotija cheese, corn, and I want to say lemon juice as well. But that, oh, that is like my favorite freaking thing to eat. Every time I go there, I get a cup of corn because it's that good. Shamoy Express, that's what it's called, is the little, it's like right on the side where you get in, you come in, it's, Mar it's the Marshall's entrance. You come in next to Marshall's and as soon as you go into the mall mall, you'll see Ulta on your left and then straight ahead is like this little square of Shamoy Express. And that's where I go. Uh, sometimes I get a strawberry horchata because that is good, extra good, and uh, yeah, the cup of corn, I mean, it's great. Mm. 
What? Hmm. I gotta jump on here real quick. Fill you guys in. But my boss is like right behind me with his truck and trailer. He just picked up two. And we're both headed down here. And we'll get a load in the morning. Like I said, I don't know what the heck I'm getting. I don't know where I'll be tomorrow. I just hope it's somewhere that it's not, you know, having snowstorms and blizzards all over the place. That would be a very, very sad way to start off my fresh week back over the road. And I just struggled through this Amazon relay trial, which is awful. But I can't complain to you too much. So it's getting dark in here. So I'll let you guys go for now and I'll focus on the drive. And I guess I'll see you later. Bye. Hey y'all. I'm doing my laundry right now. A snack for the night. Tissue foods, milk, That's my boss. Fat, fat, my boss. Fat, <laughs> and more fat. No, we ain't getting fat you here on the road. Me. I'm actually trying to lose something. Yeah, I ain't gonna lose shit. <laughs>